What's good, yo? We back, RTTV. Gang, gang, gang. And if it's your first time here, definitely won't be your last. So make sure you kill murder and smash that subscribe button. And welcome back to RTTV, where we react to everything. 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 And we're back with some Hell's Paradise, man. We last left off um, with Gabby Marawa fighting with Homegirl. They really, you know, found out that they don't really want to chill with each other. I don't remember her name. That's why I call her Homegirl. I don't remember her name. Oh, see my hell dying. I don't remember her name, man. I don't know what her face What's her face? <laughs> 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 uh, I don't even know if they said her name before. Nah, I don't know. I don't remember You, know, remember you might be right. I don't nah, know. Nah, I'm sure. You said it. I remember I didn't remember her name last episode. Yeah, it's like, it begins with an S, I think. I can't remember, though. But at the end of it, you know, we see that the other convicts, uh, convicts, some of them started fighting with each other, with the with their own guards. Some of them got disposed of. Some guards got disposed of, including Mr. Ipad, yeah, who man. we thought was gonna be him, right? Timothy. Yeah, and he's and not him. Timothy. He's, yeah. not him. he's Timothy. He's not that. Guy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I think I just goes to show you that his his person he was guarding yeah. is that strong. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, he's nah. I'm not gonna look, nah, He does look that strong. Yeah, though. he's like a mini Jatamateka. Yeah. Real talk. Yeah. <laughs> what, a mini what again? Jata Mateka. Okay. I'm referring to uh, Jata Mateka. No. Jata Yeah, Jata yeah. Mateka. <laughs> Jata Mateka. So, um, let's get into this next episode. Episode four. Oh, yeah. Last, at the end of the episode, some of these monsters in this Shino Thank You started oh, to attack. Oh, oh yeah. So, it's not getting weird. Yeah, yeah, it was eyes for, I mean, hands for eyes. It was like yeah. this. Yep. <laughs> wait, wait. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, yeah, 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 you really did that perfectly. Like, in a live action, that's you. In a live action, that's you. play the monster, bro. Yeah. All I got to do is Sorry, just, like, you put, you put a green, put a green. <laughs> <laughs> All I got to do is put a green screen on your arms, keep your hands on your face like that. Like, the perfect monster. All right, so episode four, Hell in Paradise. If you guys want to watch the full reaction to this episode and any other series that we cover on RTTV, you can check it out on our Patreon. Patreon.com slash RTTV underscore. Yeah. Let's do it. Oh, yeah, that's one of the criminals. He's the one that lopped his, his hand off? Yeah. Yeah. What's she say? <laughs> That's cool though. Yeah. I can't cut what? You have a picture out there with a dragon, right? <laughs> you know what's funny? He might actually defeat a dragon type creature on his island. <laughs> he got sentenced to death for that. So he's not really sense. a criminal. He just did one thing that was really, really crazy. Which makes him a criminal. criminal. If you do one crazy thing in life, <laughs> you're no, a but like he's not if like I a only burn one house like to the ground. He's not like a chronic <laughs> killer. He's not like a yeah. He looks like a little creep. You know who he is? He's a mini um, Maori. Is that his name from Bleach? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Whoa! Wow. He gave him the impression that he cut him. Yeah. What the hell? And more than that, he gave him the impression he was dissecting. <laughs> <laughs> no, you're right. <laughs> Boy, split his wig. I never thought about that. That if they take too long, they're gonna bring a whole new batch of criminals. Like, ah, right, yo. Y'all need to make this happen because the last group did. There you go. Yup. Oh, there's Pat. There he is. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> oh, hell. Oh, God. Santa, please. They got fingers for teeth. Help me, please. Your future is death. Your fish fry. <laughs> I love how you made that next part. <laughs> I was like, I'm like, that next part didn't sound nothing like that. <laughs> Boy, it sounded like a bass guitar. <laughs> sea bass. It's a fish demon. Yeah, I get it. It has prayer beads. Like, what are you, bro? Who are you praying to? It definitely used to be human or something. Oh damn! Oh wait, what Luffy? Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, wait, wait, what the hell? We killed it. Okay, 
Okay, no, he didn't kill him. Fight! I was gonna do another jitsu. We didn't see one since the first episode. Oh, yeah. oh I yo me. Yo. What? So he what? can actually die. Oh, dude, it's mad of him. What kind of titan creature? Ew. Yeah, this looks crazy. They look like titans. That dude looks look like, like I don't know what the hell he looked like. He's like, you know Go what? Go crazy, Gabi Maru. Yeah, that's a jutsu. Fire style. <gasps> oh, my gosh. Oh, damn. Godspeed. Oh. oh. He took it. Oh. oh. Damn, bro. I stay the glass. <laughs> nah, that's what you call a firehead. <laughs> yeah, he's wow. just going for the kill at this point. That's what you gotta do. Oh, wow. Wow. Oh, my God. Yo, how he cut his head off with his foot? <laughs> <laughs> it's an aesthetic blaze, bro. <laughs> it's a good thing they brought Guy Marvel for this mission. Girl, fight back. <laughs> oh, things are touching you. He's gonna save her. He gotta be true to the emotions he wants to protect it. It's funny how he instinctively did that because he blacked out in that moment. Yeah. Oh, you're right. Yeah. Oh. Yeah! Good looks! I like her. Me too. I like <laughs> her too. Hello. I have a wife. She's gonna be tempting him all season long. Oh, he ain't for that. You can't seduce me. She's bad. Wow. Yeah, busty. <laughs> and seducing ways are too strong. Two people need a controller. <laughs> Stop touching me, shuddy. Oh. Okay. I like her. Because she's like, uh. I don't know. She's Aphrodite. Nah, she gets in your head. I was gonna say, Maverick. Yeah. Oh, yeah, wow. what an ass. Okay, word. <laughs> <laughs> so, Makia just got tested then. Makia got killed. She told us a lot of useful information, I'm not gonna lie. I wonder what she's fighting for, for the pardon. There it is. Oh, okay. She's lying. She's lying, bro. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, he's like, yeah, he's just caught her out in it. <laughs> Relax, Rose. I feel it, though. She's like, I really don't need a reason. I'm just trying to live. Mm. She's our ally now, but she could be our biggest. Yeah, she's gonna I'm switch up on us. Definitely. But well, she already said that though. Yeah. We're gonna use each other as long as we need to. What's wrong with her? What, did she get bit or something? Because why is she acting like this? Um, the, the centipedes did touch her leg. I remember that though. Yeah, like, yo, I remember was thinking that, that same yeah. thing, bro. I'm like, yo, he saved her from the big joint, but. What happened with those things biting at her legs? Yeah, and they, uh, she did say that it's a hallucinogen when, like, you get close to those things. Look at who it is, the fraud! Yeah, I can't even say R.I.P. because you, you don't even deserve that. You're a bum. Oh, that's my homie right here. Wow, that's he lit! His, he got his brother as his guard? Wow. That's, that's fire! <laughs> that was the only wow. way that he was going to get his brother out. Hey. Yeah! Look how that yeah. proud of he is of his brother. <laughs> Look at his temperament. <gasps> Whoa! Jeez. And they had to watch. <laughs> what? Uh, 
He's one of the worst characters in the show. Hell yeah. <laughs> I only liked him because he looked like Boxville. <laughs> but his actual backstory is lame. My boy been holding his brother down. Oh no, yeah. don't die. Little bro, don't let. One of them's gotta die, bro. Do something. Whoa. He's like, I gotta turn up. Yeah, you gotta turn up, bro. Right. Like, do it yourself, bro. Where the hell did you find that? Damn, son, where'd you find this? <laughs> oh! Damn. There it is. I was waiting for one of these things to talk. Wow, that is <laughs> scary. So these are really re religious creatures, then. Yeah. Wow. Mm. Whoa. That's wow. Interesting. That's kind of crazy. This is like capital punishment. I'm about to turn out. Oh, damn. damn. Let's go. Oh, my gosh. Damn, bro. Ah! But I said, I would not be bounded by any type of restrictions in my life. Ooh. See, I was waiting for somebody to say yeah, something right. like this. Like, I'm gonna drink the elixir. Mm -hmm. Like, I ain't gonna give it to no Shogun. Like, that's the smart thing to do. Yeah. You can't kill me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's a zooming on her. <laughs> It's so yeah, funny. It. It's so funny how like things have changed. Cause I remember episode one. Home, what's the name? Homegirl, right? <laughs> Homegirl. She she showed like she's kind of strong and could fight with Gaimaro. But I feel mm -hmm. like ever since that episode, it's kind of been backtracking. Like and her weakness has really been showing. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? she has strong insecurities. That's why. Yeah, it's not even like a matter of strength. Cause I think she is strong and stuff yeah. like that. But I feel like. Where her, she had these moments of doubt where it's like her mind gets deluded and she starts thinking too much. That's what Gabby Ronald was trying to tell her. Like, stop thinking, bro. Just yeah, work on instincts. Yeah. Just yeah. work on your instincts. Because sometimes when you overthink, that's what will be the end. Especially because of the situation that they're in now on this island with the monsters that we're fighting. We have no time to think. We got to just kill fight. them. We don't even, we gotta shatter. We don't even know what, what the capability of these monsters are or the severity of the disease that keeps killing everybody, how much more worse it could get, how much more it could spread, and where it's even coming from for you to just be like, to be overwhelmed. Like, you in the battlefield. She this fainted, is bro. She this is really <laughs> the version of hell. I think, like, this is really the version of hell with yeah. these creatures and stuff. And it's like, I think someone just brought up a tag on saying, I just haven't seen a death to the extreme yet, but I think it's coming. I feel like mm -hmm. uh, it's interesting because we're in this place where we have no information. Shout out to Shorty that pulled up. Um, and gave us at least some type of context on where the hell we are. Mm -hmm. Cause I think that's the scariest thing. Like, at least if I know the enemy, I know what the enemy is capable of. I kind of have an idea of how I should fight this person even if I can't. But this is like, I don't know the enemy. I don't know what I'm trying to, I'm getting away from. I just gotta kill everything walking. Like, I gotta kind of like, I, I think it's gonna be dope watching them understand more about what's going on in this world. Like now we got deities as like, People that are killing people, we see that when they yeah. talk, they're talking about sins and killing, and I'm like, what is going, what is this place? Yeah, I'm highly curious about that, because the fact that they, like, basically carry certain, like, philosophies that's on modern earth, but then they, like, they said that they was mixing in different things, like Taoism and Buddhism, and they, like, live by that, like, but are these, like, within this world, did they create it, or did they adopt it from the outside world, and then... It seems like they're, like, fallen deities, so, like, they might have been, like figureheads in that religion yeah maybe that didn't work out and they were sent to hell something like that you mm. feel me like that's what that's what i kind of took from to it the guards of the elixir oh uh, yeah so like the, yeah exactly maybe or maybe maybe there's more than just that elixir here maybe that's mm. just one thing that you can find in this place you know yeah and i and is it like safer for people that are good people like because it seemed like they they want to kill you because you're a city or sinful person or whatever like you kill so if a person goes there that's good, how does that work? That's weird too. Yeah, yeah. I don't know. Cause I'll... like, like this person's like, yeah, like I'm a killer. Like, all right, we're gonna kill you. All right, who are you to choose what sins are? You're so righteous. But like, so if somebody was a pure or a purity to you, mm -hmm. what would happen to that person in his, in his life? That's actually a really good question. And I wonder, maybe that's why this place is affecting 
homegirl mm-hmm. the way it is right now because we didn't see her get bit although we seen some centipedes gnaw at her like robe yeah. yeah but like we didn't see her get hit get bit and like um everybody here are killers mm-hmm. her including her right including but she, her. Has, she has some kind of remorse and you know she not really every time she kills somebody it's not like um she's okay with it she still thinks about like Maybe it might doing the right thing. Yeah, because every time they they show that every time she goes to kill somebody on her blade, it reflects like the the baggage that has that the person that's dying has, yeah, and then she, she kind of has to take that. it exactly. Yeah, yeah. So that's really her main issue right there. Mm-hmm. That's crazy though. Those things is like, yo, you guys kill the insects. Nah, you gotta die. Everything has a <laughs> everything has a, a life. Fish, this, that. Well, you better tell your insects to calm the hell down, bro. <laughs> 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 insects are killing us. Yeah, I know, right? <laughs> what are you talking about? Well, actually, no. The insects, um, they don't kill. They don't kill. They just transform you or something like that. Like this, they morph your body. Yeah, they said that. Um, yeah, you're right. Because the person that was that's brought back to the real life, he was alive. alive. Yeah, yeah, that's true. And they said that there's certain insects that they only attack when you approach them. And the other insects, they act as a pathogen or hallucinogen and stuff like that yeah. when they spray and stuff like and that. And then one so, of them only eats your body when you're dead. When you're yeah. dead, yeah. 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 So, like but, yeah, but which one did they put an emphasis on? Like, for for the, the insect with the face, like, does that only face? attack if you're mm-hmm. attacking? Hmm? Nah, because they, it, the dude that cut off his arm, the dude that dragged him, yeah, yeah. 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 for right second episode. Yeah. yeah, 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 it just bit him and... And it's not an hallucinogen either. That one just was... Vicious. I like head exposing. Oh, that's what you call a hot head. <laughs> Dude, that, that attack was fire. Yeah, nah, it was. Dude, what was it called? Aesthetic blaze or something, something like that. Yeah. Yo, he cut off the monster's neck, the monster's head with the back of his foot. Think about that. Yeah, I thought I about think, it. I think it's because it's like on fire or something like that. Yeah, that's what I'm right? saying. Yeah. It's the ability that allows him to just basically pierce it as if his arm and legs are blade. It's almost like a lightsaber his hand, you know? Mm. His ninjutsu go crazy. Mm. That's on baby. I like these new characters. We just got more. Oh, uh, Chobe is fire. Chobe's Chobe fire. fire. And even Shorty, yo. Shorty's What's like really smart. Look up the names of these Bro, people. I try to look it up. I'm like, I'm not going to look it up. Chobe's a dude. Chobe's Chobe a dude Soma. Block. Yeah, Chobe is my guy. Oh, yeah. Remember that, right? I, I, I ain't doing I hate Chobe. Yo, yo, chill out, gangster. I like everybody. I'm nah, he was just gonna say that because you like Chobe, so he's gonna. Bro, that's not a Chobe. real thing. I don't dislike characters that Chobe likes. I could care less about him. He likes Vegeta, bro. I could care less. <laughs> I should only pimp side. Really, I did, at first I like Shorty, but right now I don't know, man. You gotta get nah, I don't like Shorty right now. Konoichi. Oh, you talking about all the no, one? Konichi's fire. I'm talking about the um the homegirl. Yeah, okay. The homegirl. <laughs> home girl. Home girl. Yeah, she, she belongs to be at home. She trash right girl. now. She trash right now. She needs to understand that she's in the field and that people are gonna die and crazy things are happening. The people that come back, crazy things have happened to them. So you gotta be on, be on your p's and q's. She became a damsel in distress real fast. Yeah. yeah. Like when Gabby Marlowe still was like, all right, go ahead. Bro, she like, didn't kill nothing. Not even a fly. Uh, she not even a fly. <laughs> Let alone kill anything. She didn't damage anything. She, her blade is clean. She even told herself that. She said, y'all haven't done that God, goddamn thing since I got here. But the one thing I'll give it a benefit of the doubt, I retract my statement. I like it because she's trying to maintain her humanity. Humanity. That was a really interesting way yeah, to say that's humanity. Tough. Yeah, it's it's know, tough to maintain your humanity when you're assigned to kill somebody. Yep. And when you've been killing people. Shawty, she was a new profession. So, uh, the yeah. Chobe and the Kunoichi. Kunoichi, first of all, you, she is fine as hell. And I loved her <laughs> persuasiveness. Like, she, I feel like she's really, we, she's still a mystery in terms of why she's here. Because mm-hmm. she gave a, a lot of uh, reasons. I have a little sister made up that whole response. Yeah. Do I need a reason to yeah. be the one alive? You know, mm-hmm. I, don't, I don't necessarily believe <laughs> that excuse. I think there's something deeper. Um, and I think she's uh, a more complex character than she's letting off to be because she's um, one minute she's per, uh, promiscuous and next minute she's like, yo, she's very uh, upfront about what, what she'll do to you and yeah. you get in the way of what she wants to do. So I really, I really rock her. Yeah, she just seems like she's a finesse. I don't even think she's going to be physically strong. I think she's just going to finesse. Nah, her. she's strong. You don't think so? Yeah, she's really she's strong. Bro, she was able to put this dude in a triangle, bro. You yeah. know what I'm saying, bro? Yeah, I'm tripping. Like, You're right. Bro. <laughs> what? And I feel like, yo, Gabby Marl might be the first person that her her stuff didn't work on. Yeah. So I think that's gonna be her intrigue to him. Mm-hmm. But her her character, I do think, is gonna be super uh, intriguing, and when we learn more about her throughout time, because like we don't even know what she did with this dude at this point. He's like, alright, so what did you really do with Mako, mm-hmm. bro? And he's like, 
What you care, bro? Like, leave me alone. You care all life all of a sudden, huh? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> I so, didn't think I more into that. That's a funny part about it. Huh? I never thought more about that. About what? Like, I never thought about what. I just assumed that he killed it. Like, she killed him and stuff like that. Mm-hmm. Now, like, what he questioned, I'm like, damn. What did, she was, what did she do? I think because she was lying about everything. He's like, all right, so <laughs> yeah. you told us the truth about that. That's the only thing you told us. Nah, you lied about that. Right, yeah. Yeah. That makes sense. Yeah. So, all right, guys. Well, amazing. That's definitely the best episode so far, I mm-hmm. believe. Um, we got to do some dope characters. There are reasons why they're here for most of them. Um, and I think they're going to be the essential core characters that we're going to be seeing for the rest of this season. Mm-hmm. Hopefully, none of them die. But if somebody were to die, I think it's Chova's little brother. Yo, <laughs> I thought it was going to be this episode. He's going to die on baby. Yeah, that's how I feel. But if it's your first time here, it definitely won't be your last. Make sure you kill, murder, and smash that subscribe button. It's your boy, Wells, the Anime King. It's your boy Rob City RT. What up, it's your boy DC? It's Maniac Wilkins and the Score RT. So take a market, y'all. <laughs> and that's how it was in that. The, the Round Table. table.